Hi everyone, my name is Mary Lundquist, and I'm the author and illustrator of The Little Forest Keepers, which I'll be reading right now for story time. Ash and Pud woke up extra early. Let's go, Pud. It was going to snow, and they had a lot of work to do. The brothers loaded their sled and set out. Ash and Pud took care of everyone in the forest. They knitted hats and scarves for the animals and fed them nuts and seeds and berries. Bundle up, everyone. They're so kind. The little forest keepers even took care of the shivering trees. It was very important work. That day, the boys saw something new and strange peeking up from over the hill. Ash, what could it be? They had never seen anything like this before. So they decided to climb it. Up and up they went until they finally reached the top. From there, they could see the forest all around them. But when they leaned over to look down, whoops, the thing had a face. Hurry up, Pud. They ran away as quickly as they could. When they turned around to look at it though, the strange new thing didn't look so scary anymore. It looked lonely. The snow was falling hard as the boys returned home. They were glad that all their friends had scarves and hats to keep them cozy and warm. But they kept thinking about the big lonely thing at the edge of the forest. Suddenly, Pud had an idea. More yarn, Ash? In the morning, Ash and Pud set out again, this time with some help. Again, they went up and up and up to finish their important work. It was Ash and Pud's job to take care of everyone in the woods, friends both old and new, and that's exactly what they did. The end. I hope you liked the book. Thank you so much for watching Storytime. Bye.